Hi, my name is Nicole Cutts, and I'm making this short video to introduce you to my new book, which is the second book in the Adventures of Isabel series. This book two, subtitled Journey to Orphalese, tells the story of our heroine, Princess Isabel of Eximica, on a rescue mission to the colony of Orphalese, which is the colony belonging to her country of Eximica, which is under siege right now. So she and a very colorful cast and crew have to go to Orphalese in order to hopefully rescue it from the very dastardly and dreaded pirate Flint. I'm really excited about book two. It's been a long time coming and it is very full of a lot of exciting things going on. We have mermaids, we have pirates, we have love, we have betrayal. Uh, we also have beautiful illustrations done by Wayne Rodney. And I wanted to just show you one of the illustrations aside from the cover. This is Commodore Dejwa, who aside from our uh, Captain Isabel, who's the commander in chief of the Royal Navy of Ixamica, Commodore Dejwa is, he's really the one in charge in a lot of ways in terms of being a real sailor. Um, while our princess has been trained and knows the ways of the seas, um, she relies very much on Commodore Dejwa and his, um, commanders that are captaining the three vessels, the three warships that are protecting the um, cargo ships that holds precious cargo on their way to Orphalese. Okay. So as I mentioned, this is the second book. If you have not read book one in the series, it is in subtitled The Embryo Goddess and the Morpho. And this book tells the story of Isabel's birth until the time when she leaves the palace of um, in Ixamica and starts off with her as an infant and then goes till she is about 19 years of age where she experiences her first major call to adventure and this is what book two chronicles.